So we are back. We are covering the Urban Wrestling Federation, not necessarily a match, but an attack. Without what's, further yeah, ado. And, and, and what's the context of this? So the, Before we even start, what is Urban Wrestling Federation? So what is this rivalry? And, and where in this rivalry are we at? So this is in the middle of the rivalry. No. What is the Urban Wrestling Federation? The Urban Wrestling Federation was a small fed that was based around gangs, rappers, and fighting over territory. And where was it based out of? It was based out of New York, but they had representation in Chicago. They had a representation from Philadelphia, I believe, and I think they had one in California. Okay, and what channel was this show on? I think... I think it was um, uh, one of MTV's little smaller sister channels. I can't remember. No, I think it was VH1. I, oh, could, okay. be, I could be wrong. I can't remember. It was a couple but of years it was, ago. But it was one of those trashy TV Oh, channels. yeah, absolutely. Okay. Oh. And then what is the context of this rivalry? Like, who, 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 what were the factions included in this rivalry? Uh, this was a one-on-one -on -one rivalry specifically. Okay, uh, and who was it between? So it was between... Some random guy, I can't remember, I think it was one of the rappers, and then the guy who's there was uh, Ricky Ortiz in ECW. Okay, so now we know it was someone that we're familiar with. Yes. And this was a television show. How long did this television show last? Uh, five episodes, no, five or six episodes, and I think it was over a couple of months. And why was it taken off of TV? Because it's trash, and also because they had maybe 60 people, and they tried to fill Hammerstein Ballroom. It was They were spending too much money on it. Ah, okay, so now we have the context. So... Um, what was this rivalry about? This rivalry was about, I think it was Rick Ortiz fucked the other guy's bitch and something about money. I swear to God, these people mumble, so it's really hard to get context. But all I know is that the majority of the time, the majority of the time of all these rivalries, it's about either because one dude fucked another dude's bitch or money. Okay. And, and what makes this I mean I guess before we go into it what was this kind of leading up to like what what was this clip in what was this clip about like what what are we trying to get from this clip so the guy in the ring is yelling at Rick Ortiz okay. for one of those two reasons okay Rick Ortiz insulted him and basically was like I'm gonna go down there and kick your ass okay so we're basically watching an attack so this is this is a brawl, and mm -hmm. then there will be other guys from uh, Rick Ortiz's crew come out to attack the other guy, and we're going to watch it specifically for two people, and you'll know exactly why. Okay, okay, and okay, so, um, okay, and and where is this brawl taking place? Is this at Hammerstein, or no, is this, this somewhere else? This was. It, it looked like a room in a warehouse, but it's, okay. in the middle, it's in the middle of the ring. So it's actually... So there's a ring yes. in the middle of a warehouse. Are, is there a crowd presence? There is a crowd presence. There's probably less than 100 people. Okay, so this is it's, actually it's, taking place on this... This is not something that's happening backstage. This has no. something that's happening in the middle of the ring. Yes. Okay, perfect. That's, and with all of that out of the way, <laughs> now we can start watching this clip. It is so convoluted. People go out of your way and watch this show. I might force Peanut Gallery to watch Urban Wrestling Federation. Like every single episode, you'll have no idea what's happening. So there's the other guy. And here comes Rick Ortiz. He doesn't have his big hair anymore. Well, yeah. But you can tell that's obviously Ricky Ortiz. Oh, yeah. This the, the facial, the, the face. Yep. <laughs> oh, by the way, I might, might want... <laughs> the commentary is gold here. <laughs> I, I might want Peanut Gallery to watch this entire series because the commentary is the best part of the show. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck that. Like, I, liked, I like how they did this because if they're going to do it like, oh, it's about gangs and shit, it kind of looks so backwards. What the heck is going on here? <laughs> So these aren't the two, but this is this is um, the other guy's crew. <laughs> we have that random guy. All right, so these are the two. 
the limbo the Limburg boys or whatever however the hell you pronounce that I don't know that's a, that's the other ones of Rick Ortiz's crew ah so the guy in the gray shirt near Pina Gallery and the enormous earth like dude yeah. in the middle of the ring they're called the fat pack and that's who we want to watch right now okay so we're watching the fat pack they're hard to miss because they're pretty fat <laughs> right <laughs> oh god this is this is it Oh no! <laughs> <laughs> he, he, he landed right. He landed right on his head. Like, <laughs> oh, by the way, the enormous dude that we're seeing his ass on. His name is I'm not kidding you, Big Baby Daddy. <laughs> <laughs> like his ring name. That's his ring name. His Jesus. ring name is Big Baby Daddy. He's just standing around, but, you know, these two people who are the size of planets can barely move. What the hell is that? He spun around once. <laughs> what the hell is that? Ultimate Doge. It's just... BBD, big baby daddy. <laughs> I mean, he is big. I... So that's that's. These are the Chicago crew. Okay. And that was it. Oh, that was it. That was it. <laughs> oh. You want to watch more, don't you? I don't know. That's weird. <laughs> big baby daddy. It's my favorite. <laughs> what the hell? Is this so one? that was it. Uh, let me know if you want us to cover the rest of the urban wrestling. Fed I mean, there was like whole lore and. People beating each other up. Eddie Kingston and Homicide are in this. It's great. Um, but anyways, next <laughs> week is going to be Fastlane and Wrestle Dream. Yes, we're covering both next week. So if you did enjoy this show, remember to like, follow, subscribe. If you have suggestions for matches or segments that you want us to watch, let us know in the comments. Subscribe to the channel. Become a patron. All of that will be in the description. And as always, be majestic.